Yeah, okay. Okay, we're back with the lemon meringue pies. So what we need to do is take them out, right? The idea is then we can wash these up where the meringue because this is a chocolate one, you know, just put a bit of chocolate fudge in there um, that I've made and melted. So I've got three here and I've got a spare one. So the three here, now we need to put the lemon in first. Right, but you need to whip the meringue up, which I've done. So the meringue is two egg whites and four tablespoons of sugar. But we half whisk it up first, the egg white with nothing. Then add one tablespoon, one minute, another tablespoon, one minute, another tablespoon, one minute, another tablespoon, one minute. Right, so the first thing is, we split the lemon. So I've got a bit of spare lemon here, so I might be generous and let somebody else have some, because I feel, I think I've got more than some of you, right? So we've got the lemon in. And this is the lemon, so that's roughly the right thickness, right? So I've got a bit spare here, so I might give you some because you seem to be really short. You need to turn yours off, Freddie, like I said, so you just don't miss the next bit. Now, this one here, it should be looking like this. Upside, I no, won't turn it off, let's show you. Put it on the side there, like that, with this. This is two eggs, so that's more than you need, right? Uh, it should be done, don't do that, but as you can see, it shouldn't come out, right? You can add a little bit of water to it, some chefs add, um, Corn flour now, vinegar to it if you're making pavlova, but we don't need to do that for this. We get the fluted nozzle, we turn it down, so I don't get meringue over the top of the, so the meringue's only halfway down. We put it all as much as we can in here with a spoon and pinch it off with our hands, yeah? So this is only two eggs, this goes a long way meringue. You'll have more meringue than you need. You might be able to make some baby meringues or somebody that messes it up can have somebody else maybe. Then, we do it from the outside in, the outside here, this is a lot harder than it looks. Outside, in, like that. Outside, in. Now normally, what I would do now is get another tray and just put some little ones in and cook them really slowly. You need to turn the ovens down. So I'm turning mine down to, I like them cooked quite slowly now. We've got plenty of time, so you can turn the ovens down and put them in the oven before yeah, baking. You've got to, I'm only doing about 120. If you've not got time, we do a bit quicker. And then they're done. When they come out, they're done. There's no washing up whatsoever, because I've done all my tins well in the oven. So that's it. There's only the tray and it's got the paper on. Make sure you do that. Take the tins off, though. That meringue Tegan can have, and you can have all that. be enough for your ones. Uh, and you can have my lemon, you're lucky. So anybody got any other questions? Oh, I'm going to save this little bit of lemon, a little bit secret, for me to serve mine up. I'm just going to save this tiny, tiny bit of lemon here so you can have the rest of it. Um, everybody know what they're doing? Yeah. Go. Can you change it to the thing? Yes.